Hello, hello, hello. Look who it is. Pauline. Oh, we miss her so much. Welcome to BGC Philippines. Back again. Back We're back, back again. again. We're going to have some breakfast and uh, yeah, just uh, relax a little bit because we can't check into our place until a little bit later. And what's the name of the area we're staying in? Where's? Pana uh, Paranyake. 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 Is there? Uh, I'm getting closer. I'm getting closer. <laughs> but yeah, as you can see, it's very beautiful here in Beachy Sea. Of course it is. Everything is so clean. It's a nice, beautiful morning. Nice weather. The BGC bus parks there. Oh, the BGC buses. Okay. Wow. Cool area. I didn't know they had Neither did I. And look, a whole okay. bus system. Oh. Yeah, and it's like like normal sized buses. Yeah. Nice. Not like the mini Not buses. Not like the mini buses. Or what do they call them? Uh, modern jeepney. Modern jeepney. <laughs> That's what they call them in uh, Iloilo anyway. Modern jeepney. And I'm like, it's a bus, but it's smaller. Hey, I like them, so not complaining. <laughs> not complaining at all. Bianca gets to pet. Oh, I get to pet a BGC cat. Oh, look at that. A beautiful tabby cat. Hello, baby. Hello. Yeah. Went straight for me. How do you feel about that? Don't talk to me. Wow. Let's just find out. Okay. See you later, kitty. All right, this is our destination. This is the part where you find a lot of the restaurants and shops. Which is McKinley Hill or something? Um, where you Oh, Forbestown. Forbestown. Forbestown, thank you. That's the one I remembered. And they've got the whole uh, Tree of Life over here. I think it's called Tree of Life. I feel like- We call it the Tree of Life. Most people don't see this in the morning. Right. No, <laughs> no. In the morning. Right? Our videos are always us here in the evening in the past, so. Look at that, there's the tree of life, or the life of trees. Tree of life. It's pretty, it's very pretty. Tim Hortons. Yeah. For the Canadians out there. A little bit of Canada home. <laughs> Not even Canadian owned anymore, okay. but that's okay. They have double double on the wall. Right, it says double double, so you have to have it. Wow. It feels like cold as Canada in here. <laughs> Ooh. Almost, almost looks purple. Yeah, it looks purple to me. <laughs> It's um, ube. <laughs> ube. It's the ube flavored ube coffee. <laughs> oh, I missed this. I missed this. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's in a weird cup. Yeah, why isn't it yeah. red? Why isn't it red? They have red cups too. Oh, it's for the it's for the hot coffee. This I guess. is hot. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I have a hot coffee. It's not red. <laughs> white cup for the white guy. <laughs> Well, I gotta tell you, there's a lot less than at night now. We don't have any of the supercars all lined up revving their engines. And uh, the restaurants aren't actually open, but it's just really, really quiet right now. You know, it's nice, it's very peaceful, I like it. Uh, obviously, full of foreigners, a lot of foreigners here. Of course. This is the place to retire and uh, live the, the Western life uh, for, I guess, a little less, but I wouldn't say a lot less. It is a little bit pricey, you know, that is the point. Uh, everything of the, the Western culture is available here, uh, but they have to import it. So you, you save a little bit on labor, but they're not saving anything on materials. Yeah, lots of uh, bougie pet places here for sure. <laughs> yeah, there's people with their pets and strollers and stuff like that. It's owned by one of the most expensive dermatology things. Wow, there you go. 
Well, when you get your Botox, you can get your, uh, bit your uh, carriage for your puppy. Yeah, makes sense. When New Yorkers see a tourist, they're like, move out of the way. Yeah. Oh. Not that I've been to New York, but I, that's no? what I just heard. I've just heard. Oh, yeah. Well, you've been to New York State. Yes, but not New York City. I've been to the state of New York, okay? There you go. So I've been to New York. New York here at the north. Uh, <laughs> we have I'm the only one. Hey, Bohol Bee Farm. We went to that in Bohol. Yeah, I did. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, I remember. Really that was nice. Oh, the Kuka. It is very pretty here. My goodness. Where we took our picture. Yeah. Yeah, we got it. You guys got a picture in that. Yeah. And then the Tipsy Pig where when they it's all lit up. Belgium. Yes, the Belgian Moon beer you can get at Tipsy Pig. Uh, <laughs> a lot of foreigners random, told us that before pandemic, it was actually quite common to, find, to be to be able to find a lot more German beers, oh, that kind yeah. of thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 but now not after, so much. Yeah, after pandemic, like German beer just yeah. gone extinct. Like it's gone. gone. <laughs> oh, look at that! In this truck here, you can get a, like a cheesy omelet breakfast sandwich for sixty nine pesos, and then you can just eat here in the park. Yes. And oh, look at that! A bacon cheese omelet is. 129. So that's a pretty decent price for BGC. It is. <laughs> did you do anything for Chinese New Year? I did. I went to the hot spring. You went to the hot spring? In Laguna. Is that a Chinese New Year celebration type of thing? Typical. Very it's just for our family. But, uh, okay. but they served like the um, rice cake. Okay. Where you eat when celebrating Chinese New Year. Okay. But it's a Chinese Korean resort. Oh. So it, it's uh, Kong, Kong Hei Fat Choi? Kong Hei Fat Choi. Kong Hei Fat Choi, everybody. Uh, yeah, so this is that. All lit up at night, it looks really pretty. During the day, it just looks like a bunch of wires. But mm -hmm. yeah, really good night. night. All right, where's uh, the Max one? Right there, right there. Oh, there it is. Oh, we have to go around? Yep, yeah, oh, okay. Or we can go around this way. Oh, look at all the cats. You're gonna adopt them. Oh, look at the fat one. Look at this big boy. This guy is not scared. I'm so sorry. He's like, y'all. Don't disturb me. That looks like Borat. Hello, big boy. Hi, baby. Yes. <laughs> Max's was closed and uh, if you want an uh, inexpensive breakfast, uh, relatively inexpensive, it's not going to be inexpensive, uh, you go to Denny's. So there's a Denny's about a couple blocks down uh, here in High Street. So we're going to go check it out. Oh, she wants to go touch the sign. They're going to have something going on here this weekend. Street, uh, yeah. they, it's called My Street and they shut down the street to do this. So, yeah. But yeah, Bianca's more excited about this. She wants to get her fungus on. There you go. You going to become part of the fungus? It's a good fungus. show. It's a good show. She likes mushrooms, so. It would be cool if they had like one of the, you know, like on the wall when some of the zombies yeah. are like. Yeah. That would be cool. You have one stuck on there. Yeah. That's funky. Horty Filipina. <gasps> that sounds a little <laughs> odd, doesn't it? <laughs> Does anybody know a Horty Filipina? <laughs> <laughs> What is that supposed to mean? I it feel like a name. It's right. just, oh, it's just a, a name. To a foreigner, it sounds. <laughs> just a name. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we see. They sell plants. <laughs> We're like, okay. Um, sure. Sure. Horticulture. Or. Oh, is that yes, what it means? I'm sure it does. If it's plants, that makes sense. Mm. Yeah. But a good name, still. But still. <laughs> wow, they just went all out here in BGC. You do. Zombie, Zombie girls. Wow. Yeah, they went all out. They got all kinds of them over here.
Yeah, this is like more of a permanent display than a temporary one. Wow. Oh, there's a button there too. It says. Yeah, it's a sensitive. Test with calibration or something. <laughs> maybe it's a light. Yeah, maybe you have to sit on it and then it crawls into you. Yeah, I don't know what it is. They all have them. Maybe they turn them on at night. Yeah. No. It's like lights or something. <laughs> Suddenly like a zombie comes But yeah, out. look at that. They literally put it right into the concrete here. Great. Oh, this is HBO Go Park. That's why they own it. See, it's right here. Oh. Yeah, so all the HBO stuff. They advertise it right here. They're mopping that. Wow. Look at that. Whew. It's probably right there. Oh, yeah. yeah You're going to work out? Car. No, I'm not. No. <laughs> not even a looking bit. for, looking for Denny's not to work out. Yeah, we're trying to eat. Okay. Yeah, yeah, what? Not. not Look at that. You could do the stairs. The never ending stairs here. Okay, we found it. Yes. It took a little bit of effort because, uh, yeah, somebody had selected Pancake House, not Denny's. Look how fancy this thing is. All these outdoor seating and everything. It looks very fancy. Ooh. Hello. Nice and cool in here. Sure. Table. Yeah, I mean, they probably had it in a good spot and then I uh, shifted the table. Alright, so for all you uh, Canadian Americans, whatever, uh, the All-American Slam, that is the typical, right? Everybody heard of it? 295 pesos or 525. We have no idea why there's two prices. One might be a larger portion, much smaller portion. Uh, so to give you an idea, that's about six dollars to eleven dollars and or ten dollars and fifty cents. Um, yeah. So as you can see, quite a bit more than be in the United States. Uh, it's it's definitely more money in the Philippines. But you can get Malaysian beef curry. I found out. Okay. Uh, the half. The, the lower half price, that means you get one piece of bacon, one sausage, one pancake, one of whatever, one egg. Uh, yeah, wow. So there you go. Okay, so this is the standard one. You probably all recognize this. It looks pretty much like America, you know? Uh, then we got over here. You, this is the solo or the half. Yeah, yeah. Right? So it's half the price, but yeah. it comes with. It just comes with one of each of the eggs, the sausage, and the bacon, but you get two of the pancakes. And this is for the same as yours, but half. That's right, same as mine, but half the size. But how? How does it taste? Yeah. Right, wait, wait, aesthetic. Are you ready? Are you okay, ready? I'm ready. Syrup, yeah. let's be honest. Yeah, that's true. That's true. It's and, it's a, and it's the pancakes fluffy. It's a fluffy pancake and it tastes lovely. All right. Cheers. Cheers. Enjoy. I want to see how your bacon tastes though. That, that's the key. You have two pieces of bacon. Fine. Oh, yeah. That looks kind of fast. This is a sad piece of bacon. Get in my mouth. It's a fluffy piece of meat. It won't get in my mouth. What are you, Ken? At the dinner table? Come on. We got our fruit, Pauline. I'm playing with my bacon. <laughs> it's actually really good. It tastes like normal bacon. What is this? Potato? Yeah, it's like it's, it's, hash. it's like, like a hash. It's like a hash brown thing, but I, I call it like scrag. I've always called it scrag. <laughs> it's like shredded potato, you know? 
Right. It tastes like Denny's, I gotta be honest. <laughs> well, it gave me like instant diabetes. It was so good. It was so good. But the diabetes was, so was good? The diabetes? Yeah, it was free diabetes. But it's okay. At Denny's, they have a birthday cake, not a smoothie, milkshake. And it has, it's got all the things, it looks like a birthday cake, right? So good. But I was like three quarters of the way in, and I'm like in a coma. <laughs> a sugar coma. Yeah, it, was, it was so good. But I was like, that was my one and only, because that was just deadly. Well, I've been to San Francisco many, many, many times. I have not, ever. <laughs> and, uh, but I can tell you, San Francisco, it had its day. You know, it was once a very beautiful place with those beautiful trolley cars. It's everybody appreciates and loves and the charm that comes with San Francisco. But as anybody knows who's been to